Hello people, I'm back in the world of Ark on my PS4 Patreon server, oh yes. Right then, so, the update has just hit and uh, it's come along, the, the TLC patch and uh, we've got like the Rex and the Dire Wolves, Procoptodon, the Bear and the Gigantopithecus. Uh, but first, what I want to do is, uh, is is show you something that uh, has not been covered a lot, but it's actually here. Right then, it's the creative mode for uh, Ark. Right, so if you are running a server, or, or you're in single player, and you want to build a super fantastical base, uh, then you, you can enter creative mode, which basically lets you craft everything. Right, let me show you. So, you need to pull up your uh, admin. Oh, no, no, sausage. <laughs> there we go. Right, pull up your admin command. Obviously, you need to be uh, admin or in single player. Right then. So, then we need to put in uh, it's cheat GMC, give creative mode. That's what that is. Uh huh. Uh, and then once you execute that command, uh, you'll notice in the bottom right corner, now we have a little toolkit. It's like it's a thing. So now we are in God mode and uh, infinite stats as well. So we can run forever. We're not going to die and we are free to build wherever we like. Uh, it's going to be awesome. Right now, if we go into our menu. So. If you look into crafting, and now you can see I have everything, everything, tech gear, uh, everything. Uh, oh, scroll down, you sausage. Ugh, still not used to these controls. So it's basically it's got resources as well. I don't know why it's got resources, uh, but I think it's just it should be just for the crafting mode really. But all the scorched earth stuff, um, yeah, the Adobe and things like that. All the armor, everything, basically all the weapons, the whole shebang, everything in Ark is all unlocked. And uh, you can actually craft it and uh, do with it as you will. Uh, but also you have in your, um, like in your inventory, if you've got any high level or blueprints, uh, I say blue, well, I've only got like a, a crossbow, but if I click that, It'll craft it. You don't need any material or anything. So if you've got some ridiculous blueprints uh, of, of a high level, uh, then you can craft them as well as uh, right crafting. But primarily, uh, it's it's basically for, for builders. Uh, the weight, so you notice the weight is like 999,999 million. <laughs> it's a lot. It's a lot of weight. Uh, so you can basically craft a buttload of stuff uh, and not bother about weight. You can just go as your leisure. So if we scroll up to the top, I've already had a little play over as well. Uh, but like tech stuff, we could already, we could build tech stuff. Uh, I know we haven't got any element. Uh, I don't think elements that there anyway. But we can, we can build armor. So all you do is just click it. And then there it is. Armor, yeah, head, helmet, there we go. Chest piece. And pants. And uh, what is that? Oh, wreck saddle. So we could put a wreck saddle on as well. Yeah, but we've got no element, so we can't shoot or anything, so me. Oh, I'll craft one. I'll craft one anyway. Just to show you. Um so we've got access to all the, the walls, the ceilings, the staircases, uh so now, if you do like uh, these, right, it does them in like batches of 20. So I put some on the hot bar already. Uh, so I only clicked it once, but it does it in like batches of 20. So there we go. So it's just like, and it just lets you uh, do your thing. It just lets you do your thing as well. It, what, <laughs> what is that? What is happening there? You sausage. It's that we want. Put that away. There you go. And have that. 
So it's going to be pretty handy for for me uh, because I've I've got a, uh, another server planned. Um, uh, what I want to do is I'm going to uh, use get the bosses in. Uh, so and I'm going to make a, like a on the island uh, around a bar. So I'm going to put little structures about that contain uh, weapons and things like that. So players can uh, defeat the bosses by using some of the stuff I'm going to leave dotted about the island. Oh, there we go. <laughs> oh, that's a thing. So, if you destroy it, you get resources back. Huh. Yeah, so now we've got crystal, uh, polymer and everything else. Yeah. Yeah. It would be better if it, you just got just like the building stuff. Uh, you don't really need because you don't need the materials. It's just the basic building components that you need. That's all you need. That's that's all we need. We don't need anything else. Uh, I, I'm not building anything fantastical. I'm just putting that down. Oh, I've pressed it again, so it's crafted another load. Right, we'll just dump it. Um, Alright, drop that, and, alright, uh, yeah, so we can push tech armor on, obviously we've got no element, so we can't power it up or anything, uh, but what we can do as well, when we're in building mode, uh, we can fly, so if we double tap jump, There we go. It's like, it's hard to get. But so now we can sort of move around freely. Uh, let's go third person so we can see what's what's what. Third person, right. So if you was building something elaborate and you needed uh, a little bit of height, you could basically just uh, zoom up and down, hold your position. Uh, it makes it super handy uh, because when I was building a bridge, I, I had my, I, I had an RG. Uh, and it was like, oh, it was super hard to like get him into a position and just try and hold it there. But like this, you could just there. You just like go up, and how do you go down? You you just point down. So yeah. So if you if you're doing some uh, crazy builds, um, yep, you've got no need to worry about weight. You can go up and down as you want. Uh, to turn it off, you just double tap jump again, and it should just uh, drop you down. There you go. Right. Boom. So there we go. Right then, Rexy. Can we put that up? Can we put that on you? Uh, is it classed as a costume? I think it is. Okay then. Are you going to highlight? Oh. Right, did that highlight? Oh, I'm not used to these controls. Right. Oh, it's a saddle. That's why you don't know. Right. So there we go. So right. Let's start looking at the dinos now. Uh, so the Rexy one. Uh, he's had a little bit of love. Uh, I, sh I think I showed this one before. I'm not quite sure if the uh, tech dino one is actually fitted for this new dino because there seems to be like a few gaps around his face. Because uh, it's mainly the face that's changed on these Rexes. Uh, let's take this saddle off. Um, let's swap it out for that one. There we go. Uh, I'm not used to these controls, guys. I do apologise. <laughs> uh, I do like my PC for this sort of stuff. Right. I'm thinking for... Yes. There we go. Right, let's have a look at your face, sausage. Come to me. Point your face down. Right. So, you've had a face change. It's a, a little bit more flatter at the top. Uh, it's more angular as well. I think it's more angular than that. Uh, a few other little changes as well around the arms and things. Um, 
but the big change is probably like the animation of walking as well. I think this is awesome. It's got a super tight turning circle as well. So no longer now they're gonna like walk off a cliff because they, they like they used to do that all the time. As soon as you turn round, it was like, no, not doing that. I'm falling off a cliff instead. Uh, right, get a sprint on. So now he's got a little butt wobble. He's got a butt wobble. Oh yeah, and uh, they can also climb cliffs. <laughs> They're like the ridiculous climbers now. It's unbelievable. Before, if this rock like was in your way, you'd get to this bit and then you'd stop. You'd get all juddery, you wouldn't be able to get over it, but nah, not a problem. In fact, uh, I came up this cliff earlier because I, I thought, oh, I wonder how far they can actually go. And it's ridiculous. It literally is. You can go rock climbing with them. So nah, the Rexes can just like, where you go? <laughs> we they climb up a cliff. That is a cliff, to be fair. It's not, it's not a hill. It's a cliff. <laughs> so now they can cliff climb. So you've got to be careful when you're taming these now. Uh, whereas before, you used to get stuck behind rocks and things, which used to help you. But now, nah, it's not really going to help you because they can uh, climb over everything. <laughs> oh, dear me. Right, so uh, he's also got the ability to um, make creatures poop themselves. So we need to find one. Uh, what level are you? So you've got to be lower than what I am, or you're not, you're not scared. It's only like the small dinos, really. I don't think there is anything around here. Oh, we're a bad out of stamina. So any small dinos, when you like roar at them, it makes them poop themselves. I, I'm not sure, like, <laughs> if that's like a super fantastic feature, but yeah, it's a feature nonetheless. Come here, horses. Fear me. I'm gonna make you poop. All right, see if we can make them poop. Oh! Did you poop? Yeah, you did! <laughs> poop look! <laughs> oh dear me. That's it. Is that it? I suppose for giggles. Oh, it's got a bit of a cool down. Did you poop? It's not got a big area of effect, but yeah. I suppose if you want some fertilizer in it already. <laughs> <laughs> but that's about it. Right. Let's go back. Come on, sausage. So that uh, little butt wobble. That's awesome. Right, let's get some stamina back. Stamina. As you can see, look, I've already had a play with the uh, things. So I've got another load of tech stuff there. So I already had a play with it. Right now. Let's go over, let's go do the direwolves. Let's take you back over here. <coughs> uh, the direwolf is, is probably my favorite one in this uh, TLC one. Um, because like they've got more abilities, the uh, animation's a lot smoother. Alrighty ho. So now we have the, the pack leader and they get a pack bonus as well. So I've got all these guys following this one because this one's the leader. So we get a pack bonus. Uh, can I ride you? How how are we doing for weight? Oh yeah, yeah. Because we're like infinitely light as well. So we can carry stuff and we don't register any weight at all. Because we've got the uh, cheaty god mode thing on. The creative mode. Right, let's go find something to wreck. Right, let's just have a look at this. Check this animation out first. Um, right. Orbital camera. Oh. Is that one? There we go. Right. It's, so it's like K-mode. But yeah, the, the animation on this, that looks awesome. It's a lot more fluid. A lot more wolf-like. Uh, yeah, look at them face. Look at them eyes. Now, they they do look proper. Oh, 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 careful. <laughs> right, let's go wreck things. So we've also got a, uh, we've got the the mate boosted as well, because we've got the mate boosted, the pack bonus, uh, and then, come here, stupid. Oh, oh, let's go get this Bronto. 
Right, let's get in here first. So what do we do? Uh, right, 324. Right, come on, boys. Oh, he's about dead. Oh, <laughs> wow. They just wrecked everything. Right, come on then. So we've got like a, a howl as well now. Uh, is that the one? That's it, buddy. So once you howl, the whole pack joins in. Uh, now we get the buff. Now we get the pack buff as well now. So we should like just go for everything like a lawn mower. <laughs> Goodbye. What? Right. Let me go. This jetpack requires. Oh, God. why did they do this? Like, can, can you? There we go. Thank you. Come here, stupid Gallimimus. And. Oh, can't believe it. Goodbye. No, we don't attack horses. We like horses. Anything else we can destroy? Don't say a Giga. I know you're all thinking Giga. We're not too. We, that's like never going to happen. You need about like 80 wolves for that. Because they are still stupidly powerful. Uh, unless you tame them, of course, and then they are ridiculously, like, useless. Alright, what the hell is Bronto? And come to me, Bronto. So, with the uh, pack boost, you get a, a nice little boost as well. There we go, 170 Bronto. Just chop down. Right, excuse me guys, coming through. <clears throat> yeah, so I do like the uh, dire wolf for the for the fact that it looks a lot better. Wolf eyes look like wolf eyes. Uh, and the, the animation as well. It's a lot more fluid. A lot more wolfy like. Or dog like. Right, where, 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 where was we? Was we over here? Got carried away. Jim, please! I think we're over this way. Yeah, everybody keep up. So we'll go back and look at the Procoptodon next, I think. Oh, sorry. Just a little bump. Speed bump. Right, Procoptodon. Hey, buddy! What? Right, so there's the pack. <coughs> right then, so the Procoptodon. So that's had a little bit of love. Uh, he's also got, in his patch, a Methopithecus. Because <laughs> he's got the ability to pick up animals as well. So, like, small animals. So if you're breeding... And you've got like a little rogue baby. You can basically scoop it up and uh, let that nanny it for a bit. Yeah, that's the thing. So, again, this uh, this is a lot more fluid as well. Right, get some jump on it. Uh, the jump now is absolutely ridiculous. It's like, oh, goodbye. Oh, we're going to land on the Rex. Oh, boom. Yeah, they don't take fall damage. Well, they don't take as much fall damage. So, yeah, let's not jump from there. Because I have a feeling like if we jump from there, we, we probably are going to take fall damage. So, you get like a, a little cross there. It disappears. Like, it only goes for a bit. Uh, get some height. It's a bit like the Karkin Karkinos. The crab in Aberration. Like, that is going to hurt. Surely. Oh, oh no, only a little bit. <clears throat> right, let's uh, let's have a look at the animation on that one again. Let's put it into sort of kind of K mode. Because uh, that, that's another one where the animation looks pretty good. Pretty smooth. Right. Uh-huh. And orbital cam. Nice. Yeah, so that one looks a lot smoother. <laughs> look at the patch. It's like just patches flopping about with that monkey in. Ooh, but, blit. Right. 
Uh, also, they've got the attack as well. They've changed the attack. So, he's got like a... A bite. A bark. It's like, like a bark more than anything else. Uh, and... A kick, like a kangaroo kick. How much damage does that actually do? Let's, can we boot something? We want to boot you. Ugh, it's like... It's, Scotland's nice and all, but there's like hardly any dinos at all. And then all of a sudden you'll just get a Giga that just spawns in and just wrecks everything. <laughs> like, there's no dinos around here whatsoever. It, like, there was Gallimimus around here prancing about earlier, but now they've all gone. That's lovely. Oh, oh, hey, Tyrannodon. Oh, <laughs> is that it? <laughs> we didn't even get a hit marker type thing. Oh, we can't chase you that way. Never mind. Right, let's go back and look at the bear as well. Jump. Ugh, why can't you jump, stupid? Really? There, that's better. Geronimo! Oh, we need to be over that way. So, he can jump pretty high and far. Uh, it does take a little bit of fall damage, but it's not a crazy amount to say how high you jump and how far you go. Right. Nice. Let's make it back safe and sound. So we've got the Methopithecus in the patch. Oh, did we? We dropped him. <laughs> we dropped him over there somewhere. Got a pegger around here. There, there we go. All right, let's go. Anyway, get off sausage. So, Gigantopithecus. These have had a little bit of love too, so we can see like the faces. Oh, I'll just get off. But, excuse me, coming through. So, uh, the the text. Please just disappear. This is what I don't like about console. It's like it's, it's like it's not it's not user as user friendly. <laughs> Well, it's not Jim Bob friendly. Right, get off. There we go. Right, we ain't got text all over the place. Right, let's have a look at your face if we can. Uh, I know we can turn options off and stuff in the uh, menus, but uh, yeah. Uh, it's just a matter of pushing backspace and stuff like that on PC. But yeah, so he's had like a little fair tickle as well. Uh, it doesn't look as plasticky as before. Uh, so these have had a couple of things that they've had done. Uh, they can throw you super wickedly far. Right, let's go. Right, throw me over there. Oh! Goodbye, Jim! <laughs> so they can throw you a ridiculous amount of distance. Uh, also, they can carry small creatures on the shoulder as well as you. So, when you're on... Right, let's get back on you, buddy. Um, we've got a Pego here somewhere in and amongst these. Can we pick you up? Yep, there we go. Right. Same sort of deal as well. Uh, it's a center stick. It could throw the Pego a ridiculous amount. Right. So, if we've got... Let's see if we can get him all the way to that Rex. So we'll put that over there and go. <laughs> Goodbye. Oh, just a little bit short, but that is that is a distance, that is. So basically, if you set your pego to go robbing, you could throw him into a camp and uh, it just wreck everybody. Just steal all the stuff. Right. So... I've got like a zip line from Aberration. I just did like a little bit from there to there. Because uh, now these guys, these can actually uh, climb across zip lines and stuff as well. 
So these are going to be super handy to have in aberration. Because uh, there's, there's an aberrant version of these. Hey, buddy. Right. Can we jump on there? Yeah. So there we you could, like, traverse up and down. Carrying yourself across zip lines. Uh, can we turn around? Yeah. Go, buddy. Awesome. Can you throw stuff while you're on here? No, you can't, obviously, because you've got your hands. Excuse me, come through. Now, like, we're all stuck. And... Huh, drop. Oh, we did a little jump. And finally, we've got the die bear. Have we done everything? Yeah. So, the die bear, again... Uh, he's had some cosmetic bits done. Uh, his eyes, again, look a lot more... Yeah, the, the light of day in this place is just not eh, doing it justice. But the eyes look a bit more... Bare. <laughs> uh, you can't see in this light. Oh, can we? Can, can you see there? Yeah. Uh, and the facial features as well are a lot better. Right, get on. Um, Animation-wise, now I don't know. I think it's more or less the same. It. Uh, I don't think they've made any super changes in the like the animation. No. So that's. It's just the bite. Maybe a little change in that. I think that's about the same. I think the but the like the walk and stuff is, is was pretty much spot on anyway. You know, the the big lumbering like stomping kind of gallop. That was pretty much spot on anyway for the bear. Uh what else we got? Oh the growl big stance yeah that's probably the same as it was before that's not changed so the only other ability is uh, the honey gathering so it gathers an insane amount of honey uh, I know we haven't got any honey around here so we can't demonstrate that but uh, if you come across any hives and things it, it will gather more honey than what you can get it's like a honey gathering machine well it's a bear but yeah well these are generous rates anyway on this server uh, this is my patron server so right. so I think that's it so I did cover it on uh, PC anyway uh, let's so yeah, so I covered this all on PC, uh, but it's just got released on uh, console. Uh, Xbox One uh, is going to be a couple more days later. Uh, this is PS4, obviously, but the Xbox Boys are going to be a couple of days. Don't know why that is. They normally release them at the same sort of time. But anyway, right now. So all that's left me to do is to wave. <laughs> <laughs> and see you in the next one.